water safely at the lake shore. This time, grandmother licks rocks. Salt is essential for wild animals, but chimpanzees' staple foods such as leaves, nuts, and fruits hardly contain any salt. Glekulo comes to have some salt on the rocks by the lake. This time, it's Puffy's turn. She is clumsy, but she has watched Guacullo. She starts to look for a good rock. It's not just salt that Puffy is tasting. She is tasting the world, little by little, absorbing wisdom. Gwekulu takes Puffy throughout the jungle and guides her into a broader world. She always walks ahead of Puffy and waits for her with patience. To chimpanzees, fruits are an important source of nutrition and make up over half of their food intake. There are many different trees bearing fruit at different periods of time, and the type of tree differ according to the region. It isn't easy to know when and where each fruit will be found. But with Guacolo, Puffy has nothing to worry about. They don't need to search around for fruits because there is a map inside Guacula's head drawn from years of experience. Thanks to her grandmother, Puffy can have delicious fruit every day and grow healthy. Guacolo is always watching over Puffy. What would have happened if Puffy didn't have her?
Perhaps life is like hope we find on the edge of a cliff. For Puffy, Gracula is the hope. Inko is also looking for food on the other corner of the jungle. Chimpanzees continuously move around within their territory to look for food. To the youngest one in the family, the jungle is full of wonder. This time, the sister carries the baby brother on her back and continues to climb up the steep valley. The youngest one came all the way here on his mother and sister's backs, but he suddenly lies on the ground as if he can't go any further. It's the mother who comes back. In fact, this is her second child and she must have realized that it takes a lot of patience to raise children from her own experience. Finally, the mother finds some delicious fruit. Acadia is excited at long last. Patience is bitter, but the fruit is always sweet. Even in the middle of the meal, mother grooms her son. Mother's gentle grooming always gives comfort and relief. The mother is quickly preparing the bed before the night comes. Acadia is also skillful and she prepares her own bed. Chimpanzees make a new bed every night. They pull branches to make a round and soft bed and turn in.
The youngest one is also pulling branches, trying to make something. But making a bed isn't as easy as it looks. Well, it's only the first try. The cute little one returns to his mother's bosom, his refuge for the night. The jungle is in an uproar this morning. An old female chimpanzee has hunted a baby bush buck, a type of antelope, by herself. Chimpanzees don't eat the meat they find on the ground, even when they know it is fresh. They only take the meat that they hunt with their own hands. Following the smell of the meat, chimpanzees come from everywhere. but they rarely share food they hunt independently. <coughs> Chimpanzees distinguish between what is theirs and what belongs to others. It's tempting, but they don't snatch food from others recklessly. They just wait and wait. <coughs> but there are ones that can't wait and get frantic about it. This one tried to get a piece of the meat after showing intimacy.